other is the text so what we're going to do this is why they also put the square before if you remember they had a square here so we're going to um, write square again and take this place it over here just like they did because now I know why they did it it is a good idea we're going to paint it black and now we're going to place it here position it above make it a little bit smaller and there you go you have yourself a title the other thing you can do is you can add an arrow Oops. arrow something like uh, this turn it around a little bit make it smaller oops one second and then do something like this maybe even making it smaller than this and now it looks really really good now another thing I wanted to show you is how you can add a frame to your thumbnail so to add a frame we will uh, create uh, all kinds of squares and just place it in the corners so you can create it manually before that we're going to need to take this and make it and put it over here and I'm going to show you why in one minute why I did this step you're going to find out in a minute so we're going to come back and write square again <clears throat> sorry click on it click the square okay make it wider because you want it to come out from the screen make it thinner something like this and just place it over here and now you can play with the uh, with the width of the frame you can see you can make it like this you can make it like this so let's do it in black or even yellow and the next step you need to do is to duplicate the square and then place it in each corner so let's start and make the frame I'm going to take the square, duplicate it. Now I'm going to take it and put it in this side. Okay, so now we have two sides. Now you can leave it as it is, it looks nice. This I'm going to delete, I think. You can leave it as it is right over here. I think I also want to color this yellow. Yeah, I think this one looks better, but maybe I'll do it even more yellowish something like this yeah this one's okay and now we want to add more so we're going to duplicate it take it right over here and then we want to spin it to this side so we're going to use this we'll spin it okay you can use the shift one okay the shift uh in your keyboard to make it fit now we're going to make it wider to the screen this looks good very nice now we're going to place it right over here and you want this to match this so now it looks okay let's duplicate this one as well and add another one here and now you have a frame so now you understand why I put this one like a little bit far because I didn't want the frame to hit the text and then people would not see what it says Okay, so now it looks perfect guys. If you want to make a video about how to make the best burger, you can just do this. You can go to photos and look for more burgers, photos, let's see, let's write burgers. And as you can see here, all of these pictures are free. Because when you look here, you see it says free. Everything here is free. I mean, not everything, but everything I just seen is free you can do this one okay so you can take the picture double click it delete the picture and then use like uh, so this is the picture we just had by the way so they have more this one is really good so you can make it bigger okay then click on position 
backwards and bam oh one second now we're gonna click it again whoops click this position and another one okay because the frame wasn't here so I just brought it back you can do the arrow bigger and the picture looks really good you can see it it's an HD picture and uh, it's a really high quality one so the one when they have crown in the side you can see this one costs money costs one dollar this is also a good picture but when you think about it guys this one and this one both of them looks pretty nice so uh, if this one's free use it um, so this one was one example I want to show you more examples so let's go back to the to all the templates they offer so they have music ones let's see more about music so if you have songs and you have something you you want to uh, upload to YouTube like let's say uh, you have this one indie Wednesdays so this is also the YouTube thumbnail how to make the best oh this one is our title but as you can see what it says over here is indie Wednesdays so you can do something like uh, add a text if you like starting by the way I'm sorry for the noise you're going to hear right now we have all kinds of ambulances here sometimes so uh, just ignore it I'm sorry for the noise so let's write something like how to play the guitar whoops one second the guitar do it white now you can make it bigger you can duplicate it and write something like um, beginners friendly and that's it I, I think like this picture it looks so good so you don't need to add anything besides text to this one also a free option guys so if you're doing all kinds of how to play the guitar how to play the piano how to play the drums so you can do like piano okay so we can write here piano and let's see the options so also this one is free you can just take this one one second just see how quick this is you double click the picture Oops, what happened here? Okay, so I deleted everything. Oh no, the text is here, but I deleted the picture. So we're going to click this one. Make it bigger. Put it right over here. Now the text you can place here so people will see it better. You can do it a little bit smaller. You can even do this. Look how nice this looks. And just do. Uh, piano then take this one and just place it right over here so this one looks pretty nice because you know she's uh, playing and it looks like she's reading this and playing so it's really really nice you can also add something like a circle here just write circle click this put this one over here and now you can make this one white and this one blue or this one this one can do something like this if you don't want this to be you know if you don't want it to pop out too much you can just click here the transparency and just make it a little bit less transparency now it fits really really well um, so this is another example you can go to photos and write drums and again tons and tons and tons of options guys these are free 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 look how many ones are free so uh, when you're doing Canva Pro you can get 3 million photos included which is pretty awesome um, so if you go and sign up and do the uh, Canva Pro just know you will get a lot more but 
Of course, of 